Recent media has suggested that lectins, which are found in legumes and grains, are toxic to your gut, cause inflammation, and may even lead to autoimmune disorders such as celiac disease and Crohn's disease. Uh, this is a, a total myth, and today I'm going to tell you why you shouldn't eliminate these healthy foods from your diet. Lectins are carbohydrate protein complexes found in, in all foods, but they're most concentrated in legumes and grains. It's true lectins can be toxic, but um, only if they're eating, eaten raw. And we don't eat these foods raw. We always cook them. Cooking destroys the lectins almost completely, so they're totally safe to eat. People with celiac disease are already on a very restrictive diet and eliminating more food groups would make their diet even more limited. Legumes and grains are a powerhouse of nutrients. Legumes include navy beans, kidney beans, black beans, and garbanzo beans, but not green beans. They also include split peas and lentils, but not green peas. Legumes are excellent sources of B vitamins, iron, and fiber, which are often difficult to get in a gluten-free diet. Um, they're also an excellent source of protein and can be used as a substitute for meat. The U.S. Dietary Guidelines for Americans recommends that we substitute beans for meat more often to reduce our risk of heart disease and cancer. Legumes are also er very economical, and with the high cost of gluten-free foods, it's a nice breath of fresh air to be able to eat something as economical as beans. There are many ways to prepare and eat legumes. Um, popular legume dishes include chili with or without meat, beans and rice, uh, lentil soup, bean soup, uh, hummus, and many Mexican dishes call for legumes. If you don't have time to cook beans from scratch, you can take advantage of canned beans to add to soups, stews, casseroles, or salads. Grains are also excellent sources of B vitamins, iron, and fiber. The U.S. Dietary Guidelines for Americans recommend that most of our grains be whole grains, which are often difficult to get in the gluten-free diet. However, there are many gluten-free grains, including gluten-free oats, quinoa, brown rice, popcorn, millet, there are also many ways to incorporate these into your diet, from breakfast cereals to side dishes to casseroles. In conclusion, contrary to popular opinion, lectins are totally safe to eat, and there are many benefits of keeping these foods in your diet.